Are Russian soldiers becoming hypothermic? There's a recent video of a Ukrainian drone dropping a bomb on a group of sleeping Russian soldiers. Some of these soldiers then get up, move a little bit, and fall asleep again. But is this hypothermia? Well, you can't draw conclusions about an entire army from a single video, but fighting in winter is hard. Soldiers need more food in winter. Vehicles need more maintenance, lubricants, and fuel because soldiers are running them more often for heat. You can't light a fire to stay warm because it'll give away your position. And digging trenches in the frozen ground without earth movers is almost impossible. Russia does not have some innate ability to fight better in the cold. Now, there's absolutely no doubt that some do. Especially if they grew up in a rural area with a farming or hunting background. But almost 75% of Russians live in urban areas. And yeah, most Russians probably know how to stay warm in the 10 or 15 minutes it takes to wait for the train, but that doesn't mean they know survival or fieldcraft. The temperature around Kyrgyzstan will be cold and rainy all this week. Cold isn't that bad and wet isn't that bad, but cold plus wet can cause hypothermia. So if we see an uptick in traffic to field hospitals? It could indicate that the Russian army is not prepared for winter.